today we are here in Nyeri, Wabogo ATC, where we are training farmers on uh, maize production. Uh, in this site where I'm studying, this is uh, DKC 989. DKC 989 is a variety that is highly productive, a variety that is suitable for green maize market. It's a variety that it takes for three and a half to four months and it's highly adaptable to mint altitude zones. DKC 989 is a flint variety that is very sweet for roasting or rather for green market. Monsanto is a company we have quite a wide range of varieties. We also have a DKC 833. DKC 833 is highly adaptable to areas where rains are not enough. That is the low altitude areas. It's a variety that it takes three to three and a half months. And in one acre, you are able to harvest 36 to 38 bags of DKC 833. We also have a DK 777. This is our new variety, which is uh, able to withstand the challenges of maize, lethal, necrotic disease. That is a disease that is challenging most of the farmers in the South Rift. So we've also been able to put DK777 across all the altitudes. It's a variety that is also high yielding, which in one acre can give you that six to that eight bags. Basically, as a Monsanto, our key thing is giving farmers varieties that are able to withstand both diseases and uh, drought. Because there is the challenge of drought where farmers are not able to harvest good crop, that is where we have been able to press DKC 833 for those farmers who have a challenge of food security. Then for those farmers who would want to do business with maize, that is green maize market, we have pressed the DKC 989 and the DK 7 across the altitudes. The, the thing that I would like to advise farmers, one is on seed selection, because most of the time farmers go wrong when selecting their seed. So a farmer who has been trained like today is able now to choose the seed for the right region, a seed for the right area, and when the farmer goes and puts into practice what one has learned today, he is able to see the crop that is suitable for his region and realize good yields. We are also giving farmers samples to go and test in their respective areas. So as a Monsanto company, we are able to move step by step with the farmers through training them on seed selection, crop management, and also how to select a good seed for their good regions. So basically today, this is a day where farmers can lead and identify the right seeds for their different regions. For DKC 989, it takes one 10 days to one 30 days. That is three and a half to four months to mature. But if a farmer who is doing green maize market, when DKC 989 is three and a half, it is ready for green maize market. But if you wanted it to dry, it goes to four months. Then for DKC 833, it takes 90 to 110 days. 90 is when it's green, 110 days, it's when it's drying up. For DK777, it takes 120 days to 150 days. It is a variety for the high altitude. In our country today, as the president has all along been saying, we are having a challenge of misproduction due to the drought that is there. Now, we have a variety that is DKC833, which has drought tolerance. DKC833, which takes 90 days, even if the lanes are so much depressed, it is able to give yields at a hard time with the maximum uh, management. It can even give between the six to the, the 80 bags per acre. Uh, basically, we are not very able to control uh, prices in the market because of the market liberalization. But normally, we have the recommended prices in the market. But the moment the customer collects seed from our warehouse, we are not very able to control those price prices when they reach out to the angro shops. But normally, what we do, we just give recommended prices at the retail level.